All right, what we have here is the NC Star Spotting Scope with a tripod. Um, bought this online, and the reason I bought it was because it was not that expensive. So, this is kind of the base unit. Um, it comes in this carrying case here. Um, does come with a a limited lifetime warranty. Um, <laughs> whatever that means, but here's where you, you uh, mail it back. It does say for U.S. use only. Uh, you do get a lens cleaning cloth, and then you also here have your instructions. This particular model is a 15 by 40 50. Sorry, couldn't see it there. It's real, they're real simple to assemble. You basically remove it from the pouch, screw the tripod into the attachment of the scope, um, open up the lens caps, adjust your tripod up and down, tighten and loosen the, the uh, uh, tightening uh, slides. Uh, it says never look through direct sunlight, uh, makes sense, but not surprised they have to put it there. Avoid shock or hard collisions, use the uh, lens cloth that is in it to clean the lens, keep in a dry place. Um, basically this is it right here, so you've got the slide out for the sunshade at the end, here's your focus knob in the back, here is your zoom closest to the eyelet there. Here is the base for mounting the tripod, and then here's the tripod that is included. So, that's what you're getting here. Um, when you take it out of the, out of the case, uh, well first here, let me show you this. Here's, here is the tripod itself. Um, nothing fancy, alright? So, just remember, I bought this because it was a base model, and I'm going to take it hunting and do a few things with it, but it just basically opens up like that and stands up. There's a screw to go into the bottom of the, uh, of the uh, scope itself, but it just spreads out like that. This is kind of cool because it folds up. So another reason I bought it was because it was supposed to be very compact, and it is. So to get your screw in, just tighten that up. And then, and it is in a nice little side pouch there. So it comes wrapped in some plastic here. This is your eyelet cover with some sort of fuzz on it. That goes on the eyelet here. And like I said earlier, this one is your zoom. This one is your focus. There's where you mount your scope, or your tripod rather. And then here's the cap for the end right here. So as you can see, it's um you probably can't see actually because of the light. It's a little green. And then this is black. You can probably see the contrast there. Um, this particular model, I would say, is roughly about 10 inches. Just guessing right now. Um, but it feels fairly light. Um, it should be. It's not that big. It's got a nice kind of rubbery feel to it. Um, I do like this feature, this, this slide out right here. So if you're somewhere where it's sunny, and then it just slides back in. And that's it. Um, hope that helps.